What happens when one of the marine engines on your vessel prematurely dies or dies of old age? You've basically got two options. You can either look to rebuild the engine or you can repower. And these days, it's normally cheaper to repower than rebuild. Why? The cost of parts has gone up dramatically, cost of labor has gone up dramatically, and you're still stuck with older aged engines of older technology. So here we are aboard Skullduggery. This vessel here had two CAT C7.1 marine engines, set at exactly the same, 450 horsepower at 2900. One of the aftercoolers failed, meaning seawater got on top of the cylinders, engine catastrophically dead. So what was the best option? Two brand new FPT NEF 450 marine engines. And why you ask? Because they are more compact. They are 160 kilograms lighter. They are smaller in every dimension. Previously, you couldn't even get down alongside the engine, whereas now we have plenty of room around the engines in this cat. This cat's a bit special with surface piercing drives and the NEF 450s have transformed this vessel to give it a renewed lease on life. By repowering this vessel with the NEF 450s, we've got newer technology. The best common rail fuel injection technology, 6.7 litre engine displacement, and they are going to be new and reliable. From sea trial, these NEFs being 160 kilo lighter per engine meant that Skullduggery, this catamaran here, popped out of the water so much faster than the old Cat C7.1s. It performed exceptionally, cruising at about mid 20 knots, and we achieved a fantastic 32 knot sprint speed out of this boat here, which is stellar, absolutely fantastic. And the NEFs did it with ease. Repowering is what we do best here at THT. So if you're in a position where you've had the unfortunate incident of an engine failure, then before you just commit to rebuilding your engine, give us a call. Consider repowering with two brand new FPT marine engines and reap the benefits of a cheaper outcome and newer technology. I'm Josh from THT. Thanks for watching.